Hi, it's Mr. Al, and today we're going to be taking a look at the Pebble Go online database. To get the Pebble Go's online database, all you need to do is type pebblego.com into your browser, and it'll take you to their homepage here where you can log in. Once you put in the username and password you've received from class, just hit the Go button, and you will be sent to their database homepage. Today we're going to be taking a look at the science database to go along with our planet research. PebbleGo has two main search functions. The first is the keyword search at the top of the screen. To use this, all you need to do is type in the subject you're looking for. In this case, we're looking for planets. And you'll notice, as I type in planets, PebbleGo will automatically try to give me a list of topics that I'm searching for. If I click on planets here, it will take me to the list of our different planets in the solar system. But to show you the other search method, I'm going to go ahead and go down to the subject listing and click on the Earth and Space Sciences. After that, I can go to Space Science and then Planets. From here, all you have to do is pick the planet you'd like to learn more about. For our demonstration, I'm going to use our planet Earth. Once you've entered an article, you'll notice several tabs at the top of the screen. These tabs will give you different types of information about whatever it is you're learning about. You'll also notice the speaker icon here. If you click on this icon, PebbleGo will read the article for you. There's also highlighted words in articles that you can click on to bring up a glossary definition. And again, if you click on the speaker icon, PebbleGo will read that for you as well. PebbleGo articles also include media that can be found here in this section. This article on Earth has a video. Other articles might have photos or sound files that go along with the information. You'll also notice in this section different links to activities related to your topic. In this case, there's planet activities. You can also print the article if you'd like to print it out and use it as a resource sheet. Or, if you'd like to get citation information, you can click on this button here. Be sure to always include the citation information whenever you use information from PebbleGo. That way we can tell where you got your information from, and PebbleGo will get credit for the work that they've done. That's all of the basic features on PebbleGo's online database. As always, if you have any questions, feel free to find me or email me, and I'll be more than happy to help. Good luck with your research.